All right, here we have another tulip poplar tree, really distinctive leaf. And as you can see, something has been chomping down on the leaves. If you look here, I think, yeah, here's one. So this is a Promethea silk moss. So this is one of those really big giant moss that you see, um, really pretty, uh, kind of an amber brownie red color. But the caterpillars are, I think, cooler than the moth, really. So they'll get a little bigger than this. Well, they'll actually get a lot bigger than this. They'll about double this size. And, uh, yeah, the little spikes, horns, nubs, whatever you'd call them, get bigger and spikier. And, uh, all in all, yeah, it's just, uh, it's kind of a, almost a cartoon-looking caterpillar. They remind me of the the big fat caterpillar you see on the uh, Alice in Wonderland cartoon. All right, so we've got a little red bud tree here. And if you look underneath this leaf here, we've got a pretty cool looking little caterpillar. Now, this is one of the slug moths. Um, the moth isn't terribly impressive, but the, the caterpillar is super cool. Um, most of these have spines that, if they don't sting, they at least itch really bad. But, uh, yeah, so really cool looking. Almost doesn't really look like a caterpillar at all. Um, it reminds me, there's a Pokemon in the, the, uh, one of the games that looks a lot like this, and I cannot think for the life of me what the name of it is. So, if, uh, any of you Pokemon players out there wants to chime in and tell me what the uh, what the Pokemon is that looks very very similar to this is I would like to know but yeah so kind of a neat little thing uh, for a second there it came into focus enough where you could see the hairs on it or the spines or whatever you would call it but yeah so typically if you see something that looks similar to this just don't touch it they uh, I don't know I've never been stung or or noticed any effect from them but i've never touched one either that i knew about but a lot of them can if it's not painful it at least itches really really bad so but yeah another cool find all right and here we have a sugar maple and it's got a different kind of slug moth on it so again same thing as with the last guy probably don't want to touch these guys but yeah, so that's another kind of caterpillar. And again, I'm not sure of the exact species, but it's in the slug moth uh, family. And as you can see, the caterpillar looks sort of slug-shaped, I guess you would say. But yeah, another neat find.